My name is Sandra Koenig. I own Quality Catering and port pit Barbecue. Uh, it's got two names because we do fundraising and then we also do very nice high-end catering. We're open to the public two days a week, Wednesdays and Fridays, 11 to 7. We feel like we're Statesville's best kept secret. It's a neat business. Uh, it's hard. Sometimes people see us and we're having fun. We're smiling, we're laughing, and they're like, you guys got a great job. And it's like, we do, but we work really, really hard. And uh, we've got a good crew, got a good team. That's what we like to call them. Guys in the back help us, and we help them. The cookers are portable. They, they hook onto the back of a truck. We can go on site and cook. There's a lot of organizations where their funds have been cut. United Way, different churches, fire departments, and they have to fundraise from within. They fix big barbecues, they sell the plates, we sell them the product at X price, and then they resell it, and then they make a profit. So we go right on site. Uh, the guys, they show up sometimes at 2 o'clock in the morning, set the tents up and the, play, and the tables, and they begin cooking. And then around lunchtime, they're all ready, and people are ready to sell plates. But it's a great fundraiser. It sells itself. If you, uh, if you say you've got port pit it's a registered trademark, and you know it's us. It's got to be us. So you won't find us everywhere. You know, we're very special. Uh, the chicken's always consistent. If you eat a piece of chicken today, and in two weeks, if you are somewhere else and you eat a piece of port pit chicken, it'll taste exactly the same. Uh, we cook pork ribs, and we smoke barbecue. Shoulders, pork shoulders, and pork butts. Uh, the chicken, the guys put it on the cooker. It rotisserates over the charcoal down into the sauce, and that's what gives it that golden, almost a little blackened color. And it remains very, very juicy. It takes hour and 15 minutes for a round to cook, so it cooks slow and it dips every time it goes around. And something about that charcoal smell, it's like, mm, makes you makes you want to come in. It's like when your neighbor grills. It's like, okay, I might have to get my grill out because it smells just way too good. We have had customers come in on Wednesdays and Fridays because they have drove by and they have smelled the barbecue. Sometimes we have lined out the door. They pass every food place in town to get to me. Uh, we're not the cheapest, but we're very fast and uh, they get good food at good prices. And we cut up with them. We try to make them feel special because they are and they're the reason we're here. People call and say, you know, what days a week are you open? This, I mean, what days are you open this week? Same days, same time, same food. Meat, two vegetables, and piece of bread. And really, really good iced tea.